Today's video is all about how to become a millionaire by copying a millionaire. Hey, this is Mark with Freedom Hunters. Welcome to my channel. Before we get started, I'd like you to remember to subscribe to my channel and hit the like button and hit that notification bell, the little dingy thing, so that you get notified when I put on a new video so that you can stay in tune with this journey that we're on. Today's video is all about how to become a millionaire by copying a millionaire. All right, so now that we're in the computer here, I wanted to talk to you about how to copy a millionaire to become a millionaire. What do they do? How do they do it? And there are seven simple habits. What is the first thing that you need to do to become a millionaire in your mind? Let's think about that. The first thing that millionaires do is they read all the time. I have a mentor and I asked him last year how many books he has read over the last 20 years and he paused and he opened up a document and he showed me the list of books that he has read in the last 20 years. It was over a thousand books. 20 years, thousand books. How many books a year is that? That's 50 books a year. That's like a book a week. That's crazy. Okay, well he's a self-made multimillionaire, been retired for many years. If he did it, maybe I should consider doing it, right? I'm going to pause right here and say, you know, a few years ago, I didn't understand this. I read a few books here and there, and I thought, oh, my mind's pretty good. But it wasn't until I started failing, after attempting and trying more often, failing, and where I realized that my mind was not doing very well. I was really struggling, and I started getting a little... I wasn't very positive or optimistic in my speech. I was a little bit cranky, a little bit grumpy, but millionaires, when they read, they develop a mindset to overcome challenges with their mouth and their mind first. They do not allow circumstances to dictate where they are going. All right, number two, what do millionaires do? They invest. They don't just spend. They invest. They invest their time. They invest their money. They learn how to invest to make their money, make money for them. They don't just spend. They have a mindset of invest first, spend what's left. When I say spend, frivolous, uh, discretionary spending. They invest their time. They invest their money wisely. So that's how they can become millionaires. And if you and I start copying that mindset of just learning how to, where can I invest my money? Where can I spend a little bit of time to invest, not spend? The third thing that I found that they do, millionaires will find a mentor. So I, let me ask you, do you have a mentor? What is a mentor? Listen, just find somebody who's a little bit further down the trail than you and ask them if they would be willing to help you improve your life in your finances, in your attitude, maybe it's in your health or in your relationships. Just find someone and ask them. It's not that hard to find somebody who has more success than you. The question is, will you ask them? How do I copy a millionaire to become a millionaire? Well, the next step is that they use dreams to set goals. Let me ask you, when was the last time you set a goal and then laid out a practical plan to go get it and you achieved it by hard work, dedication, perseverance? Have you done that recently? Re for me, recently I just set a hard physical goal and I worked at it for four or five months and I accomplished that goal and the sense of uh, believing in yourself and eliminating self-doubt really, it's amazing and how powerful when you prove to yourself that you have what it takes and that you can do it. So setting a goals, use your dreams to set goals. And if you haven't set a goal in a while, I bet you I know why, because you have failed a time or two or three or four. Aww. And so you quit setting goals and you figured why bother? But I'm telling you, if you want to become a millionaire, you got to copy a millionaire and millionaires set goals. And you need to learn how to set goals and go after them. Don't be afraid of failing. If you failed in the past, that's why you need to go back to number one, two, three, is you need to read and you need to invest your time and you need to have a mentor and then when you set your goals you'll be better prepared to accomplish and crush those goals so well the next step is they create to-do lists they create to-do lists and they systematically take care of business so that then they can have the freedom to do what they want to do you create to-do lists and then your time is better spent 
on doing those tasks or even delegating tasks that you don't want to do yourself. But when you create a to-do list, your day is efficiently planned out and you can have success. So that's what millionaires do. So I figured, hey, I'm going to do that is creating multiple streams of income. Don't just depend upon your job. What does that mean? Consider doing a side hustle. Consider doing another business or looking at ways of making money. There are tons of ways to make money online in this day. I mean, that's why I have entered the, the digital space because online businesses are becoming so common and there are so many people that are becoming millionaires. Uh, my wife and I a few years ago started investing in real estate and we had a coach, we had a mentor, he gave us books to read and he helped us get invested and, and we have been very blessed. We, things have gone very well. Have we had challenges? Oh yeah. But we, uh, multiple streams of income is what we're trying to do, diversify. So in case one source of income dries up, you're still good. So you've got real estate income, you've got uh, internet marketing or digital assets or things like that you create online, or, or you can have other sorts of things that you do. You can even have another business that you can buy, but that's what millionaires do. So I want to copy that. If that's what they're doing, then hey, I'm going to do the same thing. We're going to copy a millionaire so we can become a millionaire. All right, this is always a favorite one. What is the next step and how to copy a millionaire so you can become a millionaire? Well, you see it. It's written down there. It's right there. They avoid time wasters. Turn off the TV and your phone. If you find yourself being absorbed in things that are not creating lasting good memories and you're just wasting your life on TV watching other people do exciting things, let me, let me throw something at you. Why don't you turn off the TV and create a life for yourself so that you can be the one out doing those things and videoing it and having a great time. If you find out how to turn off the habits that are destroying your day because you're just spending your day, you're wasting it, you're not investing in anything, then avoid these time wasters. Turn off the TV, turn off your phone and get either get into a book or make some plans. A lot of entrepreneurs, they work their day job and then in the nighttime, they have to work their business or their side hustle or their online business or even work on real estate. That's what we did for a couple of years is that during the day I was remodeling homes, doing construction and at nighttime, I studied, I read, I listened to my mentor. I listened to teachings. I turned off the TV. I turned off those things that were time wasters and I invested my time into my brain. I did not allow those things to take over my schedule. All right, so there you go. Those are the seven habits of millionaires that I have studied and read about. You notice that well, I noticed that all these different research things that I did about what do millionaires do, how do they become millionaires, not one of them had to do with the opportunity that they had as far as a business or, or making money. It all had to do with the mindset. It's because of their mindset. It's all about the mindset. Did you notice that I spelled that wrong? It's all about the mindset. <laughs> you gotta love that. All right, so there you go. Those are the seven habits of millionaires how to copy a millionaire so that you can become a millionaire. You notice I laid out these steps and it's really not that difficult. These are things that you can do and I can do. So this is Mark with Freedom Hunters. I'm glad you could be here today. Hey, if you haven't already, subscribe to our channel. And please leave me a comment. I'd like to hear what you say or what you think about this. Where are you at in the journey? Because we all can grow and improve. And if we do, we'll have our best life real, real soon. So have a great day. We'll see you later.